Hello everyone, good morning. If you are new here, my name is Emily. Welcome to my channel. You should definitely subscribe and stick around. Um, today is Monday. I actually was supposed to work this week, but the boy that I nanny actually tested positive for COVID yesterday, so I'm no longer working this week. I'm kind of just chilling. thought I would vlog today. I'm kind of doing like a little life reset. I got to clean. I got to do laundry. I got to get groceries. So it's going to be a little like reset vlog, um, but I thought I would take you guys along with me. Um, it is 8.42 right now. Later on, I think I'm going to take Rocco to the dog. Um, because it's actually not going to be that hot today. I think the high is like 85, which is like outrageous compared to like last week when it was like 95 degrees every day. Um, so like 85 is still like hot, but not like nearly as hot as it has been. So I think I'm going to take him to the park today. Um, later on, like probably after lunch. Um, but yeah, I kind of want to like do the grocery shopping and cleaning and laundry and all that like this morning <clears throat> and then this afternoon take him to the dog park i also have to edit and upload a video to youtube from like last week's vlog um but this morning i finished the book i was reading i just finished things we never got over by lucy score i gave it five stars i loved it it took me i think like three weeks um, to read. It was the longest book I've read. It was like 500 something pages. Most of the books I read are like 300 something. Um, so it did take me a little bit, but I loved it. I thought this story was really cute. It took me a little bit to like get into it, but like once I got into it, I was like, this is so cute. Like I loved it. I just started my new book that I'm reading, which is Heart Bones by Colleen Hoover. I only read the first chapter, but that is the book I'm now currently reading, I kind of, like my goal is to read like every Colleen Hoover book. I just, she's my favorite author right now at the moment. I just love her writing and love her like storylines. Um, so I kind of want to make it a goal of mine to read like every Colleen Hoover book she's ever written. So I've been doing like a Colleen Hoover book and then another book, a Colleen Hoover book and a different book, a Colleen Hoover book and a different book. So I just read Things You Never Got Over by Lucy Score and now I'm back on Colleen Hoover, and then I'll read a different author after this book. So just so that I'm not reading, like only reading Colleen Hoover books, um, I do wanna like switch it up. So. just stretched. I am about to take Rocco on a walk and um I just like sat down and kind of like came up with a meal plan so I can make a grocery list so after I take him on his walk we'll go to the grocery store. All right it is now 9 33. I am about to leave to go to I'm gonna go to Aldi first, and then I also have to go to Walmart, so we'll go there after. Um, but yeah, let's go. Hello, I am back from Aldi and Walmart. So here's a little grocery haul. I had to get a lot of like household items and things too. So <clears throat> it's a little bit more than just groceries, but yeah, let's get into it. So I'll start with Aldi first. Something I got that was a little bit unexpected, not on my list, was this waffle maker. It was on sale because it was like a Aldi find last week and they didn't like sell them all. So this week they were like on sale. Um, and right now I only have a waffle maker that's like a single use one. And honestly, I don't even know why I bought it because <clears throat> it takes like hours to make waffles to like use the whole batter, but yeah, anyways. So I finally got one that's like a full-size waffle maker. So pretty excited about that. I got some tortilla chips for tacos this week. Some bananas. 
We're gonna do Asian pot stickers one night and we still have a couple left from like a bag in the freezer. So I just bought another bag of chicken pot stickers. I got two boxes of mac and cheese. We needed some more dryer sheets. So I got some of those. Um, I'm gonna do like smashed potatoes as a side. So I got some baby gold potatoes. Um, we are out of butter, so I got some more butter. And then since I'm pretty much gonna be home all week, I am gonna make like chicken salad for lunches. So I got some celery and a cucumber for that. And then the last thing I got from Aldi is a salmon. We're gonna do salmon for dinner this week, which I have never made salmon before, so this will be my first time, but. So that is everything from Aldi and then from Walmart. I got a thing of juice for Elijah. I got um, a shower liner. Our shower liner was like super gross and dirty, so I just got a new one. Um, some like Swiffer wet jet pads. Um, Mexican rice for tacos. I got some of this like rotisserie seasoned Purdue chicken breast for the chicken salad. And then I had to get some more little Airwick sprays for our little Airwick air freshener upstairs. The only scent they had was apple cinnamon, which like is fine because I guess it's about to be fall, but that was the only scent they had. <clears throat> and then I got a thing of laundry sanitizer that we have been out of for a while. <clears throat> Got some croissants for the chicken salad. We do a little chicken salad sandwiches. Jeff peanut butter is back in business, so I had to pick up a jar of that. I got half gallon of milk, a lemon for the salmon, queso for tacos, and then some salt and vinegar chips to have for lunches. So that is my little grocery, I guess, haul. Um, I'm going to put all this stuff away and then probably have lunch because I didn't eat breakfast. So I am quite hungry. And then honestly, I'm probably gonna take Rocco to the dog park after that, um, even though I haven't cleaned yet, just because the longer I wait, the hotter it's gonna get. So I'll probably take him like around 12. Hey guys, it is now 12.49. We just got back from the dog park, hence why Rocco is very tired. Here's Miss Phoebe. Um, but we stayed for maybe like 30 minutes um, just because it was hot and he got tired. So, um, and he was the only dog in like the big dog area. There were like two little dogs in their little area, but he was the only dog in his area. So he just played with like a rope toy that I brought, um, played a little fetch and tug of war. So that was fun. And now he's got some energy out, which is good. Um, and now Phoebe wants to be all playful and cute. Um, but I am going to unpack a little bit from my lake trip and get like my dirty clothes together and start some laundry and then while the laundry is going I am going to edit um, and upload last week's vlog so I can get that up it's like halfway edited maybe I just need to finish it um, but I want to get it uploaded today so I want to work on that and yeah it is very hot it is only 86 which is not as hot as it has been, but how you feeling, Michael? Phoebe. Everyone's doing good, so.
Hello you guys, good morning. It is the next day. I did not vlog anything after Rocco and I went to the dog park. I don't think. I don't know. I don't know what the last thing I vlogged was, but basically I didn't do any of the like resetting things that I wanted to do. Like I didn't clean and I didn't um, unpack. I did do laundry, but I haven't folded it yet. Um, so this is kind of like part two the next day. Um, cause Elijah came home extremely early. Like he came home from work at like two, which is very rare. So we kind of like spent the rest of the day together. Um, but yeah, it's the next day. Today's Tuesday. Um, I am about to make waffles for breakfast with my new waffle maker that I got from Aldi yesterday. So I'm pretty excited. I'm about to like open it up and like clean it. I'm also doing a TikTok day in my life today. So if you are not following me over there, you definitely should at Emily Sieber 12. Um, yeah, it's 8.33 right now. And I think I want to take Rocco to the dog park again because that was really fun yesterday and it's supposed to be a pretty nice out today too but i think i'm gonna take him like after breakfast like closer to like 10 maybe um because it'll be like 81 degrees then like even cooler so i think i want to do that today and hopefully he can like last a little bit longer out there um so let's make some waffles here is my breakfast, got my waffle, and then I did a banana on the side. Yum! Hey guys, I am about to take Rocco to the dog park. It is 10.10 right now, so let's go. Hey guys, we are back from the dog park, I gave Rocco his Kong out of the freezer to like pull him off, but he's just sitting and panting. He had a grand time at the dog park because today there are actually lots of dogs there. Well, not lots, but when I first showed up, there were three other dogs. Um, <clears throat> and then maybe after like 10 minutes, two of them left, like with the same owner, she had two dogs. So she took both of her dogs. And so then it was just Rocco and one other dog they were playing and then another dog showed up which is actually a dog that has bit Rocco before and I was like a little nervous because Rocco like immediately wanted to go and play with him and the dog like growled like rrr, rrr, and I was like oh no 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 and luckily at that point Rocco was like already pretty tired from playing with the other dogs like he didn't like really try and play too much with that dog um and he came back to where like I was sitting and um then another dog showed up and he played with that dog while the other dog left and then literally as we were leaving another dog came so <clears throat> he got to play and run around and it was a good time but um now it is what time is it 11 58 we were there for like over an hour i'm pretty sure um so Hence why he's so tired and there's Phoebe trying to nibble his toes. Um, but I'm not sure what I'm gonna do right now. But yeah, Rocco is extra tired, which is good because that means he won't be so rambunctious today. And I'm glad he's been able to like get outside and play because the past few weeks it's been so hot. He hasn't like wanted to even go outside really. So I'm glad he's able to like run around and have fun instead of just being like cooped up in the apartment all day. So yeah, even though he is extremely tired and panting, he had fun. <laughs> hey guys, so I just finished eating lunch. It is now 1.20 and I'm going to get started on cleaning it downstairs. Um, I really have to just like clean the floors and the kitchen well, really, I kind of have to clean everything. Um, so I'm going to just do a time lapse of me cleaning. Um, and then we will move on to upstairs because the upstairs also needs cleaning. So 
Let's do it. Hey guys, it is now 1.56, almost two o'clock, and the room is all clean, well, minus the dirty laundry, but um, the room is all clean, and I am now going to just lay in bed and read my book on my Kindle. I'm currently reading Heart Bones by Colleen Hoover. Um, I'm like very like new, into the book like I'm not very far into the book um so I'm going to probably just sit here and read some honestly might take a nap we'll see but I've unpacked I've cleaned I feel good and like just refreshed so 